Welcome back, everyone, to our quarterfinal coverage. The action's about to resume in the Wembley Arena with Game 3 between KT Rolster and the Koo Tigers. And the teams are tied at one win apiece. Crumbs, I'm coming to you first. In regards to the pick and ban, we saw Koo stick with two picks, the Fiora and the Vigar, change everything else up and find much more success. Yeah, um, I think for these two games, the draft has been won by Koo both times. I think the first game, KT just outplayed. Koo didn't really understand what their comp was doing. This time around, though... Their compositions, I like to think about it as a bit of a fusion burrito. It's got a little bit of everything. So you have that four-man You're seat. just hungry. You're just hungry. Coffee. So it has uh, Elise, Vega, and the Caitlin and the Shen for the Siege. So the whole core of that is Elise cocoons from afar, good peel, and then you put down the cage and you go with the Caitlin Peacemaker, easy to siege turrets. We saw how effective that was against the LeBlanc. Now, I have a whole problem with the LeBlanc, but I just want to focus on Ku's composition, and that in the 1v1 scenario, Fiora, we've seen she pretty much outscales nearly everything. And when you have a Shen with that, nobody can 1v1 her. So now you have a four-man unit that is stronger than their four-man unit, and a 1v1 that is also stronger, which highlights just how poor KT drafted there, in my opinion, because they really didn't lack have a win condition besides just crushing lanes, and that didn't happen. Yeah, both drafts from KT, I think, have been rather poor here, especially what they're up against. They're lacking wave clear. They're playing against Siege. I think if you're going to go with a LeBlanc again, you really want to do that, you ban the Vagar. In game one, they banned both Elise and Lee Sin, and they still gave Hojin Rek'Sai. So those two bans, I felt, were actually misused, and they should have been banning something else. You can drop the Elise, first pick it yourself, get rid of the Vagar. I feel like they're falling short against these sieges, and they're struggling against that champion in particular in those scenarios. It's like, speaking of the junglers, I feel like score is the only reason they've been, like these games have been close at all, because I feel uh, the same way you guys do about the draft is cool, has like a better draft in both games. But like, to me, the Hojin's play has been too predictable. He's trying to pull the same gang twice against a person like someday, like the consistency master. And he's ready for those lane ganks that are very inconsistent and risky because you fall behind on camps and, and it ended up when Darius being 2-0. And with that in mind, I need to kind of highlight the fact that Koo Tigers, if they kind of just ease up in the early game, Hojin plays a more consistent style, maybe they aim for the lane swap, then I think it will increase their odds. They're clenched up, but Tam Kench isn't even in the game. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> you know, you saw it coming, man. Um, the play style from Koo has just been coming down to the drafting, and you talked about Someday being consistent, but I'm just not seeing it these games. Yeah. The wording just the isn't score there. is consistent. He set Someday up for success there, yeah, and yeah. Someday, to a degree, threw it away. Yeah, yeah with yeah. that, with I, that I gank. I completely yeah. agree. Someday actually threw away a large portion of the game when he got caught on Renekton, and then everybody tried to back him up, and they ended up going down as well. So I, I don't think he's hitting that same consistency mm. stride in this series just yet. Yeah. All right, well, enough from us. The players are ready as we step inside the venue for champ select. Prey explains the edge he sees in his lane matchup. My role, 선수 같은 경우에는 이렇게 후반형 후반을 보는 캐릭터를 좀 자주 한다고 생각하고요. 그 반면에 저는 뭐 <웃음> 초중반에 좀 힘을 넣어야 되는 캐릭을 할 때도 많고 그래서 그쪽이 많이 후반을 도모하면 초반에 좀 이득을 많이 봐서 후반에 부셔버린다던가 약간 그런 면이 차이점인 것 같아요. <웃음> 